what makes a good science communicator. Hang on, let me think about that. Um, someone who realises that people already know science. Yeah, this is the annual uh, physics communicators um, award that we're looking for as people who are creative and imaginative in the way that they are telling other people about physics. Because people innately know that things and items and objects behave in a certain way. It's just a case of us jumping on that and being able to explain it in a way that makes sense to them so they can understand the things that they already understand. Yeah and um, trying to encourage people very early in their career um, to, to keep on going and to become the stars of the future. My top tip for physics communication is to think about your audience and think about the things that they'll be interested in, what knowledge they would already have, and to try to aim any communication or writing or talking about physics to that level and to not necessarily assume that they have the same background or interests that you have. I think people don't realise how much physics they actually innately understand just by being a creature in this world that is subject to the physics laws. They actually understand a lot more than they think. And you can relate complex um, physics concepts to everyday relatable things very easily and then people are more likely to understand and remember them. It's always enthusiasm. If the audience doesn't believe that you're interested in it then you know you'll get nowhere with them. Get to know the people you're talking to I think is the key. Go meet people, go and see what interests them and that's the way to connect. You've got to find a way that you can both build on a picture they have together and that's the only way you're ever really going to get anywhere. It's all about constructing that mental image of what physics is. Once you're there, it's easy.